Welcome to The Alt Kings, Episode 7. I'm your guest, Warlock and Key, and today we're going to be shilling my NFT project, Creeds. Enjoy. Mm. Mm, one of the finest creations to ever exist. <laughs> we're glad to have you today, Warlock. We hope you're doing great. Thank you. Thanks for, thanks for having me on and all that fun testing we did before recording. Oh, yes. <laughs> Technical issues galore. Now we are finally doxxed to the public. Everybody knows what me and Corbin look like now. Yeah, I'm so, sorry. You have to and it face. surprised no one. <laughs> <laughs> no one was surprised that you looked like that. I can tell oh, you God. I wasn't. Maybe. Really? <laughs> really. I was like, yeah, that's Perfect. about what I figured. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. So, Crete, tell us everything. Yep. They're so unique. Call like, I've never Call seen anything like this. I've literally well, never seen you, anything like you. this. We yeah. can't shorten it to war because otherwise YouTube will censor us. Literally. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. No, nah, I'm not trying oh, to get banned for that. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, jeez, well, well, Doc. Uh, let, me, let, let me talk about the, my project thing. Uh, so, yeah, I, I make creets. Uh, my process is basically I sit down, I get some paper out and a pen, real paper, Real pen, authentic and, uh, concept. I, I, well, no, not really. I don't have a concept. I just draw. No, it, it and was. I, no, don't make jokes. This is not a joking <laughs> podcast. This is very serious. Yes, yeah, I, I should have known. I apologize, Master. I will. I will not interfere. Thank you. Thank you. I draw. Um, sometimes it's horrible, and then I crumple that paper and throw it away. Uh, but I try to do it in one session. Um, this is because I feel like it. And also, I think some of my best ideas, some of my weirdest creeps come out when I'm just like going. Uh, like when I used to, when I was in high school, I used to doodle a lot. And I found that the, <laughs> the doodling I did where I was really quickly trying to finish the whole thing before class ended, that was some of my best stuff. So I, I'm trying to keep that spirit alive. Nice. Mm -hmm. you, the pen doesn't follow you, you follow the pen. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, it's kind of like drawing improv. It makes it fun for me too, so I'm not just like sitting there agonizing. Like they could be way 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 more detailed. Um, but it, as a character design thing, you don't want to go too far. Yeah. And it, it keeps them simple, keeps them special. Um, and if I mess up, you know, something I taught myself a long time ago with drawing is like I would always use pen because you can't erase. And it teaches you to be a more confident artist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it teaches you if you make like a little weird mistake. Um, I think uh, Gribgar was one of the most popular creeps and a lot of him I wouldn't have come up with. It was because I was trying to fix mistakes while drawing. So that's Very that's, cool. you know, my my process. So, when so when do I get to tell you about the lore? <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, go, go for it, man. It's, you know, go for it. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna front load this so we can just talk about BS for the rest of it. Uh, cool. Dude, I'm so excited. <laughs> so, uh, Crete, as you might have guessed, if you've got a big brain like, like me, uh, is, is kind of short for creatures. They're all creatures. And they were all created by a lonely, insane, and totally not based on myself warlock with magic. Uh, the problem was none of them liked him. They didn't want to be his friend, and he just felt horribly spurned by this. So he hated them and uh, froze them in the second dimension uh, by making them NFTs, also known as non-fiendish thaumaturgy. That's what that stands for. <laughs> He's got a whole story behind it. It's amazing. It so, works. Yeah, yeah. It works. They create the creative around works. the tower. It works. Yes. They're rolling around the tower. They're, they're you know, ripping on his hair. Mm -hmm. It's awful. He can, he can only seal about 10 at a time, you know, so that's why they come, come out in, in, in batches of 10. 10 designs, 10 mints. You would hope 10 H-bar, but no. <laughs> it's much higher than that. <laughs> Unfortunately. It has to, yeah, it has to be worth your time. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I have a, I have a lot of fun with it. Uh, mm -hmm. compared to a lot of projects, I'm, I'm very art focused. You know, I like making my dumb videos where I LARP as a warlock. I like, I like having fun with what I'm doing and having fun with, with people. And nice. We, that's we what we it's about. Talk about you, gotta, some of the... 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think so. We're moving to a lot of, uh, you know, gamification stuff. We're, we're moving to a lot of uh, utility focused things. And, and Ethereum kind of went through the same thing, but now they're shifting, you know, back to art. I'm hoping that happens <laughs> because I'm not exactly the best with utility. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that. That's okay, that's okay, I, I like just doing art. So your project's not well, based off ready. of your your project's not based off of Ethereum. It's based off it's on the HBAR blockchain, right? Yes. Yeah. True. Why'd you choose HBAR? It was very easy. Someone was like, "Hey, you can mint this thing for really cheap and start selling NFTs of your weird art tomorrow." And I was like, "Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds good." And then, you know, I started thinking, oh, how am I going to approach this? Because I was already drawing weird creature boys. Like, sure, I, sure. I wasn't like, oh, you know, what's going to be my gimmick? I kind of <laughs> can really only draw one thing. So I was like, let's do the thing I do. The stranger, the better. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like I like making weird stuff. I'm super I was super pleased because some some of the. All of them. I think almost all of the. Uh, series zero creeds were stuff I had done previously. Um, all of series one I I did like after you know being a, maybe not all the first series but yeah series series one I you know that's when I like fleshed out my process and I got better at making things and they're they're all fresh boys. Nice. Um, pretty pleased with them. Some of the ones I like the most, not the most popular, but you know, <laughs> you know, you never know. You never know. Exactly. Yeah. You can make a, uh, like a little spinoff, like a show or like a comic and call it Stranger Cretes. <sighs> I don't get it. Cause there's a, there's a show called Stranger Things. Oh, Stranger Things. Is that, um, is that on PBS? Netflix. It's the only, the only channel I watch is Netflix. PBS. Oh, Netflix? Netflix? Yeah. Is, that, is that new? Yeah, I wouldn't know. 21st wouldn't century know things, we understand. You, oh, you've okay. aged a little. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You played me so well on that. That was... <laughs> We're out of a hey, and now right people now. can see you clapping, you know? This is, this yeah. is the future. This is true, and it'll help me line it up in post. But yeah, uh, I'm 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 generally a big dummy, and uh, so someone, some people that I knew in the HBAR Discord, where previously I was just joking around constantly, were like, "Hey, you draw a weird thing, why not do this?" And then I, you know, started learning a bunch more. Um, there's a really loud car outside right now. I don't know if you can hear that. It's beautiful. Uh, I wish I could. Yeah. Oh, you can't. Well, that's that's no. awesome then, because it's really annoying. Anyway. Uh, there was there was never any chance of me going on a, a Ethereum because I would have had to put in my own effort to figure out how all that worked. Because I'm a lazy boy, <laughs> and probably honestly a pretty big investment up front. Yeah. Oh yeah yeah yeah. I don't I don't I don't have any Ethereum. Well, I think I technically do. The only reason I have Ethereum is because when I was buying that Dovu thing, I had to buy Ethereum whatever token thing version of it right and then port it over i need ethereum to like port it over to uh, hts or whatever that's the only reason i have ethereum never had it before wouldn't have happened why it's by for whack. life <laughs> <laughs> represent 30 cent represent <laughs> See, Corbin, uh, yeah, Corbin's some, the, maybe, maybe someday corbin's the hbar guy i'm the xrp guy but he still knows more than i do even though i put him on all the crypto yeah this is true <laughs> That's, He's got I a bigger brand than me. He does NFTs too. I don't know how. Yeah, I, I don't yeah know it's how not it as developed as the HBAR network yet. But not yet. We're getting there. I'll tell you that. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait the HBAR network's developed? I mean, <laughs> you're technically able to like mint. It. You're technically hey, able hey, to mint. Hey, it's more so than XRPs in from an NFT perspective. Yes. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's unfortunate. Bro, remember HBAR's uh, NFT stuff like a month ago? Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Nothing. And two months existed. ago? Woo. Yeah. Well, it, but the thing is, like, we had we had minting tools when I yeah. started in, in November, right? Ooh, it feels like two years, honestly. It, it does feel like two years. It feels like forever ago. <laughs> it's been 84 years. Yeah. Especially for me, this, like, I had to learn so many things in this crazy world I've been in. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a layman in almost every way, and now I'm now I'm also hosting a 
Hedera related podcast. I don't understand how it happened. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, like a month after I started, like uh, exact minting thing stopped and everybody was just like, uh, OK, this is fine. <laughs> <laughs> now, what do we do? Luckily, I had already minted my Series 1 Creeds by that time. Ah. But a lot of people were like, ah, I can't make new stuff. And I'm like, haha, the lazy boy wins again. I'm not going to make anything new for like two months anyway. Keep it scarce. But yeah, it's, it's crazy and weird and strange, and I love it. I love being the underdog. And that's a good thing. Yeah. It's always good to be the underdog, to be mm -hmm. honest. I don't, I don't love being underdogs. <laughs> that, you know, that can get messy and scary real fast <laughs> anyway <laughs> so where'd your name come about warlock and key uh, where'd that come from okay warlock and key uh, i'm gonna try to make this boring answer as not boring as i can all right you can do it in the voice <laughs> about you i uh, will you, we can meet the warlock later we're not do gonna bring voice. him out for this <laughs> Uh, about two years ago, well, he, it had nothing to do with the, the character I created later of the Warlock. Just like two years ago, I was like, I had written a play um, that had a Warlock in it because I, I have problems. I guess I'm obsessed with like three things. And uh, I was just thinking like, hey, you know, it'd be a good screen name. Warlock and Key. It's a kind of a pun and it's got Warlock in it because I like Warlocks. That's it. That's it. Later, now it looks like I'm planning because I've, I've, I've maximized the amount of use I can get out of it. Now it looks like, oh, he, he was thinking about this. Shit. I just like warlocks. And I, wanted, and I like puns. Yes, you're quite the punny guy. <laughs> I want to throw up. He's a jokester, <laughs> He's a jokester that's for sure. <laughs> I want to throw up. You're not uh, old enough to, to do that. You don't have the, like, I've got three kids and two grandchildren cred yet. And a, and a golden retriever. Yes. The, and, the, yeah. It's like the, the puppy of the first one. Yes, exactly. We've gone through, like, a family dynasty of dead golden retrievers to get to this oh, point. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm hey, trying to make this as, as, least, as least about Cretes as I can. You're succeeding. That's the goal. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we're, we're running uh, out of I want you to buy my stuff, please. Uh, please buy my things. What? What are they selling? Is that, what, is that what I'm supposed to do? No, 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 no. When's the next, when's the next release of Creed's coming? Well, so recently, you know, I, I'm still waiting for people to buy the Series 1 stuff so I can stop thinking about it. Um, so I've been doing a lot of collabs. I did one with Crypto Dogs. People really liked where I just... I mean, I was I was so glad he let me do that. So, you know, for people listening, I, I, I maybe you can throw up a picture in post. Yeah. yeah. But uh, so he makes, you know, you, you guys are familiar with the Boston Dynamics dogs or whatever. He makes like, you know, his artistic interpretation of those. Really nice guy, by the way. Oh, absolutely. Um, he's, he's a G. And I, I thought it would be so funny if I just made like this disgusting early biological prototype where it was like a real dog, but they experimented on it and he had like bones for legs. So it looks like the Boston Dynamics legs, you know, <laughs> it's fantastic. And I just I, I just Seems thought that terrifying. was so funny. <laughs> oh, and I drew it because the 3D model. Anyway, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, 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 yeah. So so I drew it. Um, and just cause I, I came up with the idea, sat down, like sometimes creeds are like that where they just, you just go. Uh, sometimes it's a whole day of throwing things away. Glare was like that. I went through so many mm -hmm. different versions. I just threw away. Um, but that one just came and I didn't hit, get his approval. I was like, I, this is really freaky and weird. And also like kind of macabre and, and dark. He's probably not going to go for this, um, because my first collab was with um, ANFT emuls, something that reads fine, but it's very hard to say out loud. Mm -hmm. um, and I just drew an absolute freak. I just drew a disgusting cat. He's like, oh, make something based off my H cat or whatever. I just made a disgusting. <laughs> it had like a weird growth. It had a weird growth on its face. It was just upset. Oh, and God. He was like, oh, I remember that. Terror. Terror within that cat. 
<laughs> yeah, he was like, no, thank you. Please draw another. So I was worried that was going to happen with the crypto dogs guy. And he was like, no, it's fine. I was like, oh, you don't think it's too weird? He's like, oh, it's weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird, but I, I expected that. I was point. like, cool. Yeah. And then he made a 3D model version and just brought that nasty boy to life. Am I ugly? My eyes! My eyes! <laughs> and I got to like fill in some lore things with my tweets and be like, oh yes, the uh, subject alpha, because his name's alpha because I like puns, so that you think about it. Um, subject alpha, he keeps screaming whenever we have to put him down and then bring him back. It's getting a little annoying. Maybe he's upset that he doesn't have eyelids anymore, so he <laughs> can't close his eyes, you know, just stuff like that. So I had a lot of fun with that one. That's uh, so yeah, I, I, back to the actual what you asked me. Um, so I've been doing a lot of collabs and stuff. I just I just did a collab with Moon Tickets where he, he took one of my creeds. Wait, did three wait model. Moon like, Tickets? I thought it was Moon Crickets. <laughs> oh, his, his name is Moon Tickets. But the project's Moon Crickets? Yeah. Yeah, right? Anyway, his name's Moon Tickets. <laughs> moon Crickets, some... Uh, lemony Snickets. <laughs> uh, anyway, he, he did a 3D model. I cleaned it up in Photoshop and changed some of the, the contrast. Wanted to, really wanted to make those Jeppa's eyes nice and bright. And uh, then made a funny video, and, and people, are, people seem to be enjoying it, which is, which is always good. Uh, Crete Series 2 is coming. About half the Cretes are done. Um, I'm kind of just, I'm kind of just, I want them to be really good this time. I want them to be really good so there's not like, you know, we have two or three favorites at each time. I want it to be at least five favorites. Ooh, that's going to be taking a my time, one, bud. I know. And it's always the, and it's always the most time. random ones, too. Like, I remember the very first favorite from this series was Squizness. It's literally like this octopus that's in a suit. <laughs> it's yeah, I did, not, I did not anticipate. Also, also he's not an octopus. He's a squid. His name he's is a Squidness. Squid. Or sorry, sorry, not Squidness. Squizness, as in squid in business. Horrible pun. It works. Just, just awful. Yeah, did not expect him to be a favorite. Uh, I think DJ was the first yeah. one. He was like, this one needs to sell right now. Immediately changed his PFP to it. And I'm like, dude, I'm dead. This is... <laughs> and it sold, right? Yeah, it sold out. It's, it's, it's sold out. Thank goodness. I can, I can eat for another week. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I, 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 gotta, I think I got to auction off the vert at some point. I, I do the 10, and then I do an invert, which you might think is lazy. Okay. Hold, bear with me here. You might think selling a one of one invert is lazy. You would for the first series, you'd be right. I did it at the end. I uh, it was lazy. This time, I specifically take the invert into account before I even design the basic version. So like Golok is like a rock monster. The invert makes him a snow monster, kind of an abominable snowman versus Bigfoot type thing going on. I I I build a little story in my head. Makes sense. With I these mean, ones. I can, yeah, I can tell. I mean, you've had made a whole storyline for this whole entire project, it seems. You might want to repeat that because you cut out, my friend. Uh, well, I said, like, it seems as if you've made a whole storyline for this whole project. Well, yeah, pretty much nobody knows about it or reads it. <laughs> uh, but it's important to me. And I, I think about it, you know, because I, I write my own little scripts for when I'm doing yeah. my dumb Warlock videos and... You know, I have to it has to make sense to me because like a lot of the videos will end if you like listen it, like the warlock will say something that like hints to the fact that like um, he's actually a sweetheart like yeah. in his he's he seems mean, but he's not. He's just upset that they spurned his love. Um, so like the alpha video where he's like, ah, a disgusting creation of magic and science at the end. He's just like, um, <laughs> I'm sorry. They made me do it, you know, it's so I, I have to it has makes to make sense. sense in my head. Makes sense. It makes all the sense. But yeah, pretty much nobody knows any of this stuff. Like people have bought like a bunch of my NFTs like they're like, oh, what? Or they'll be like, you make videos like uh, <laughs> you, someday. What's it? What's insane about NFTs is you think 
you think, okay, based on regular marketing things, right? If you're if you're marketing a children's book, you're like, okay, we got to have a blog post about this. We got to have like a little video. Uh, maybe we'll have some VO for the video, like with the characters, get people interested. NFTs don't work like that at all, <laughs> at all. People, people don't even care what it looks like. They're like, oh, no. you got a poop emoji in uh, one? Oh, what are the utilities for this? <laughs> like, that was my next question. That was actually my next question. Utilities. Yeah, we, we currently, friends, we got one utility. If you buy a Crete, you get a discount on future Cretes. Excluding collabs. Sorry, friends. <laughs> if you get a Crete's vert in an auction, the, the one of one inverts, you it bumps you up to 25% off future purchases of Cretes. Hey, I'm trying will, to will think of utility that. stuff. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> and it's something like hard said, to provide. I, uh, yeah. Utility is very hard to yeah. provide. Especially if you can't program. Yeah. yeah. Or, you're or if you're not Gary. buddy buddy with really uh really big big boys. If you're not buddy buddy with the big boys. And they can't just like do it for you. It's tough. Yeah, yeah. yeah not not, ev- not everybody can be friends with Baptiste. <laughs> not everybody can be friends with Baptiste. Not everybody can be friends with Patches. You know, like us bottom of the barrel boys. You know, we're here. You know, we're you're doing, alive. We're you're making it. We're yeah. alive. <laughs> So I, I just hope that people go back to more of an art focus um, because uh, that's what I do. <laughs> yeah. No, it yeah, definitely will wrap yourself. back around. I mean, if you think about it, cool cats probably really didn't have any utility in the beginning. They just were cool cats. And when people see value in things, it doesn't necessarily have to have utility. It's just about... It's, it's really just about how people perceive value at the end of the day. Well, I mean, it, you know, when I die, which might be soon, you know, you probably sell them for a good amount. Yeah. You know, I, I you know, I, I, I don't drink, I don't eat sweets, but I also don't exercise. So it'll probably be soon. <laughs> Invest now. You, get, you gotta get those arteries moving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go, 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 come on. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna live very long. So get in, get in while it's hot. 10K H bar per one NFT. I see it. Please. <laughs> I mean, well, some, some of these people, they want insane returns. I'm like, guys, guys, like, like with secondary sales, I think you remember this whole thing where someone was like, oh, you know, like, let's make a deal or whatever. And they're like, you know, I want I want 10K for this if I'm going to sell it. And I'm like, guys, remember, we're Cretes. <laughs> this is yeah. Cretes here. Boy, you got that NFT for free. <laughs> <laughs> I think you can come down a little bit. I think you can come down. Let's be realistic here. No, no. He knows NFTs what he is, is so insane. It's, it's yeah. like wrapping your head around it is insane. But what's really hard is me wrapping my head around the heads of other people. It's crazy. Sounds I, complicated. I try to learn, but I sometimes I'm just, I don't get it. Everyone's brain thinks <sighs> differently. Yeah. And it's very hard to wrap your head around. Yeah. You can't really ever with, justify yeah. somebody else's thought process. War- Warlock's built different. <laughs> <laughs> so is his art. <laughs> I was born this way, okay? I was born this way. <laughs> so should we have him do it? Do what? Oh, yes. We, uh, <clears throat> what are, what are you, uh, I was, do I have to take my shirt off? You're being detained. <laughs> you're being detained. <laughs> Finally! Can someone tell me what is going on here? <laughs> we we want to ask why you were selling unregistered securities. Oh boy. You recognize them? No. Should I? <laughs> anyway, that, that's a that's a nice couch over there. You want me to sit on this couch? You're gonna have a nice interview. What, what is this? <laughs> why are you bringing out a video camera? <laughs> <laughs> what what kind of casting session is this? No. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? Okay, so with everybody I interview, I ask them for a state of the H bar. And Mm -hmm. what that essentially is, is it's like a state of the union, how the president gives a state of the union over how like America is doing. Um, But from a creator's perspective, or from a creed. Creators. Let me interrupt. Let me interrupt you because you have just stumbled upon the mystery pun that I've been struggling to. I've been struggling to make creator and Crete connect. 
for the entire time I've been doing this. I think it, it should be Cree tours. Awful. I think it should be Cree tours. <laughs> it just it, there's it, Cree tater just sounds like Cree tater. Like potato. It sounds like it yeah, it sounds like tater tots. Yeah. Cree tour. It's not. It's, there's not enough. Like, <sighs> no, my pain. I do. I've been trying because it's like it almost fits. It oh, almost so close. works. So if, if anyone wants to reach out to me on Twitter at Cretes underscore NFT, you know, buy my Cretes, whatever. But really what I want to <laughs> know is how to make creator and Cretes into a pun that works that people can listen to. And he can say out loud and it makes sense because I've been I've been struggling. OK, French, I've been struggling for a long time with this. Please finish your question. I'm sorry. I'm, sh- I, I'm trying to host it. I'm trying to host it or something. Hey, you want to host the show? Know. Go for yeah, it. I mean, I you did the intro. You did the intro. I don't. I, I, I know. I, I'm kidding with you, I, bud. I, I. State Wait, of the Union. I'm joking. It's a Okay. What, what, is that? what does that mean? What is, you want me to, like, try really hard not to mumble? We want to see where you stand on H <laughs> You, is, you need to make complete. Really hard no, 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 you, you need to you need to make complete sentences. <laughs> yeah, it's very and difficult. And not stumble. Oh, and then also don't read the uh, the the stage directions either from the teleprompter. <laughs> Warlock looks to the left. Let me tell you more about <laughs> yourselves, and then yeah, uh, state of H bar. I mean, are you talking about price? Are you talking about? What are you talking about? No, I'm, t- I'm talking about how it's how its ecosystem is, I guess. It's just it's, it's a big question. So like how. All right. I'll just I'll just start talking. I'll just start just talking. ramble. Just go for it. All right. So here's here's my all my thoughts about HBAR friends. Um, why the hell does number not go up? Oh, what are we doing wrong? <laughs> Uh, what what ancient Aztec god did we piss off that the number shall not rise? Uh, it's been weird. It's been a weird past few months for H bar. Um, it's been a weird past few months because one, we have not been having good price action for various reasons. I mean, most things are not doing well right now. But also, we've been having a lot of news. We've been having a lot of news. Uh, if I tried to, because once again, I'm the host of the Hedera Hashcast. Please follow me on YouTube so eventually I can monetize my videos. Already plugging. If my I man. had, <laughs> if, if I had started that podcast six months ago, I would have had pretty much no content. You know, there was really not much going on. But we've had a lot of stuff going on. We've had a bunch of, you know, Hedera DeFi coming up. You know, the NFT space has actually been blossoming. Uh, it continues to grow as much as I was, you know, hating earlier. Like it's it's really growing. We're having a lot of people come in. We're having a lot of people developing things um, for NFTs and also for Hedera. You know, there's the saucer swap stuff that's going on. You know, hash packs getting better and better every week. Um, things are looking really, really bright and really good. It has not connected to any price action. I mean, the boys, they announced that Ubisoft is going yeah. to join yeah, that's major. the council and nobody really cared. Nope. It pumped, <laughs> like, it pumped like two cents for like a day and then just, <laughs> and, and then went back down and went back down. I mean, that, that's like, if another chain got that kind of announcement, they'd be rolling. Oh, and yeah. uh, so it's it's strange. We we've been also I didn't even mention the fact that Hedera is going open source. Huge deal. Huge deal. You'd think because, I mean, that's all the people, all the detractors are like, it's not open source. Burr, burr, burr. And burr, 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 I understand burr, 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 <laughs> but but, you know, now now your burr, burr, burr is is burr, burr, burr. It's it's finished. It's yeah. it's going to be open source now. And the the number didn't really go up. <laughs> so I guess state of H bar is just like, you know, cause I've been holding for, for a while, not as long as some other people, which you might think, Oh, well, at least you haven't been holding as much as these guys. No, those guys got in so early. Oh yeah. Like I Their got in, I got with in a two or like a one or, yeah, two, or yeah, like four like, digits instead of like five or six. <laughs> yeah. I remember like around this time last year, I think it was, at like 30 cents, maybe 35 cents. 
And it's like, it was pretty consistently around the 30s for a while. Mm -hmm. yeah. And that's when a lot of people got in. That's, you know, around where I got in. And it's just like, it's just seeing that number slowly fall and then crab, 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 after already crabbing for a long time. I mean, we, we thought back then, oh, look at it. It's been crabbing at 30 forever. Like, yeah, come on, it's going to go up. It's like, no, it's going to go down to 22 cents. And it's going to crab there. What? Like, if you told me, like, <laughs> oh, all these new council members have come out, we're going open source, blah, 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 and, I'm, and, and you told, you know, past me, yeah, and it's still at 22 cents, barely holding on. I think right now it's, like, shifting down to 21. Yeah, it is. It's Basically, right uh, if you like um, hurting yourself, if you like masochism, <laughs> I would suggest holding H-bar, because it is just... It is just the least fulfilling uh, token, currency, crypto, whatever, g goomble gobble thing to hold. Uh, it doesn't even dip massively to like give you some kind of satisfaction of like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm buying a dip. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it goes out a little bit and then it'll stay there and maybe it'll go up a little bit. It's just. It, it is awful. Uh, <laughs> Wait till they get sued by the SEC. <laughs> It, it it is uh it is awful but the technology is is very good and the future is extremely bright and it's just baffling uh the state of h bar is is baffling yes it's, it's indubitably indubitably well done well done yeah that was really good what's your favorite creed I think you already said this earlier. My favorite yeah. creep. Well, he's so I, aggressive. Uh, <laughs> What's your favorite creep? What's your favorite creep? Because he's uh, turning me into I a have, creep right now. <laughs> I have I have some back here. Let me let me uh -oh. look. Let me look. Hidden content. Uh, unreleased. I'll, I'll these unreleased. What? Once? No, no. These are all released because uh -huh. I, I keep the drawings. You know, proof that I I do draw them. I'm not I'm not memeing about it. There's not like a bunch of like eraser markings. Like, oh, let's fix this. Uh. Let's Let's see. He's he he's somewhere in here. I forgot that you can't really hear me if I turn away. Probably a surprise to uh, most Crete's fans out there, all twelve of you. It is Rook. He's great. Not a very uh doesn't sell very well. He's in he's in the bottom <laughs> tier as far as uh, sales. But I I like him. I think he's solid. He looks like but, he's got a uh, crown on his head. He could be yeah, the new he, ambassador he for the All Kings. <laughs> <laughs> he he kind of looks like now now stay with me here. He kind of looks like in chess a rook. Yeah. Wow. Tons. I got five of them. <laughs> yeah. So that's that's my favorite Crete. Do you have the sketch for uh, Glare? Yes. Yes, I do. Glare is one of my favorites. He was look in, look, don't look into his eyes too long. Oh my god! Yeah, he's he's a he's a lot better when uh when he's when he's colored in, obviously. Yeah, but yeah, the color ads, the color Beautiful. ads. I need to get I need to get better at coloring things. To be honest, Warlock, do you have any questions for us? What do you want to know about the Alt Kings? <sighs> Why do Why you guys have more know? subscribers than me? <laughs> it makes me mad every day. Marketing, brother. Why do you have more Marketing. subscribers? Promotions. Um, every everybody who's subscribed, go to subscribe to me, uh, Hadera Hashcast. Oh, we'll be doing uh, a please. giveaway with you. Yeah. <laughs> give me, please, give me subscribers so I can monetize. We love you. I bet love. like everybody who watches my videos like uses AdBlock. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, hey, I've got YouTube Premium, so every time I watch you, you should get a little uh, cut of that. Oh, yeah. I I get nothing currently, but maybe in the future. Maybe. So upcoming drops are TBD, right? Yeah, yeah. I need to, I need to finish my series finish two that. free. Sure. I'm trying to I'm trying to do like you know do some more collabs before I before I start shilling the big boy series again. Um. Yeah, yeah. Waiting a little bit. I, I'll let you know. You can follow me at Crete's underscore NFT. Mm. Or, you know, if you are interested in my podcast that is not about me shilling things, and I don't really get to make jokes very often, or it's not as many as I like, at Hedera Hashcast on Twitter. It's um, very strange for you that you have to actually be, like, kind of formal. 
<laughs> I guess. It's, it, it feels I, like you're outside of your comfort zone. You have to be kind of formal. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I, yeah, I, I get people complain a lot that I focus a lot on structure, um, but I like structure. Yeah. I like I like having bookends to things. Not everything can be the alt kings. Not everything can just be, you know, freewheeling, <laughs> relaxed. This stuff. is the alt kings um, podcast. <laughs> it's like forgot. you know yeah. <laughs> when the saucer swap people want to come on you know they they, they want to know like okay how how is things gonna be structured you know people you know when you have guests they get antsy and they they i think the structure adds a lot even though it does make things more stiff but hopefully i'll get i'll get better at, at hosting so it doesn't seem so stiff though yes every single time i'm freaking out like oh i hope stuff doesn't go wrong oh i hope i record it this time oh please <laughs> Please, nobody say anything incredibly offensive. Oh. Um, <laughs> Has that happened yet? I haven't noticed anything. No, no, I'm I'm probably the one that I need to worry about, <laughs> not not my guests. They're pretty they're pretty squeaky clean boys. That's good. I you think a few on YouTube? have been dropped. Ooh. No, no, I mean yeah, I mean I I, uh, I I do uh, do the the thing you're doing where I just record or, it in Discord. Or like post them on YouTube. I mean, sorry. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I put I put them on YouTube. I also they're on Spotify and Apple Podcasts. Um, which you 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 know, with the amount of people who are like make a video version, which I'm sure you're familiar with. Oh yeah. You'd <laughs> think that <laughs> you'd think that like pretty much everybody just does the YouTube. Uh, but no, no, a lot a lot of people on Spotify listen. A lot of yep. people on Apple, well, not a lot of people on Apple Podcasts. Mostly just Spotify. Yeah. So, yeah. I yeah. put it on Apple Podcasts as a courtesy, really. <laughs> yeah, we weren't even going to do Spotify until Vicente kept like bugging me like, hey, hey, when Spotify version come out? Hey, 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 I'm at the gym. Hey, hey, hey. Good. Do yeah, always something. Yeah. I'm like, all right, all right, I'll do it. He wants to listen to our voices while he works out. That's what he wants. <laughs> I don't know if that's a Maybe. good thing or a bad thing. Well, you know, it's a Maybe podcast, he just so imagines can... beating you up. Maybe oh, he's my. just like, he's just like, Ugh. you know, he just has to get into that mindset. Like, oh, well, I don't after, well, well, after he, well, after he sees our faces, yeah. that will for, further confirm it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> oh, great. Now I got a mental image. Oh, I can't wait. I can't <laughs> wait for that day. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm, I ran out of questions, Corbin. You got any more you want to ask him? I'm trying to think because we have one. Here, I, I, I got one. I got one for myself. Um, uh, uh, what, what, what could you know? You were, you know, uh, Warlock. You were kind of, uh, you know, poo pooing, as some might say, on H bar a lot. What, what's something they could do to improve? Well, here's what they could do to improve. They're focusing way too much on B two B business to business marketing. They need to mix it up. You can. You can target businesses and corporations and also target retail. Yeah. You can do both. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like maybe you got to make two YouTube accounts. I don't know, but you can do both. <laughs> you can do both. Maybe they I, need to make a video I, with the horses in it. That would be good. <laughs> that would be I'll good. just show you that video. It was just, it's a long story. <laughs> It's a really I, story. I, I think they're going to do that. I don't think that I'm a genius. Uh, I think that people have been screaming that same thing at them for months. I think they're going to do that, and it's going to be easier for them to do that now that they're open source. Mm -hmm. I think the main thing, because it's great technology, we've got great people that are a part of the, the council. We've got great people like that are starting to build on it. Um, and you know the HBAR Foundation, people hate on them, but to give credit, they're 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 seeking out good projects and and yeah. giving them money, which is always good. I think it's going to get better. I think I think the marketing is going to really help because that's kind of the last piece of, piece of the puzzle until we go to the moon. We're going to be billionaires. Um, when Lambo, which I you know I hope happens. <laughs> when moon, <no>. yeah. <laughs> You know, people always say win moon, but why not? Why Ferrari? Yeah. Why, why are you shooting that small? Why not win Bugatti? Win. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a car either. guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm not really either. If, I just need a Tesla. If, That's all I need. 
Word, word. If a I Tesla became fabulously wealthy, and if if I became fabulously wealthy and I had to buy a car because I just don't care, I'm just gonna like I have my used car that I'm just gonna run to the dirt. If I had to, it would just like what's what's the car where I don't have to focus on driving? Are we there yet? Can can I remove the steering wheel? I don't need it. All right, you really shouldn't have trusted me with it in the first place. To be <laughs> honest, take it away. I don't need it. Which apparently there, there were I, I thought it was like a pipe dream that we'd ever get to that point. But apparently like NVIDIA is like working on mm-hmm. doing, a, you know, a lot more technology with that, which please, please, I hate driving. I hate it. I think a lot of people do. And I think that's why Elon Musk was born. I guess I'm in the minority. To solve the here. problem. <laughs> I guess I'm well, yes, is, some people some people are like, oh, you know, if I just want to waste five hours, I'll just drive like, I, dude, I got st- to do i don't want to stare at the road and get honked at but some people are like i find it relaxing wasting my time and money with that gas oh hey, five i love it no i hate it. Gas. there you go yes yeah, it's, it's awful it's awful save us elon also make uh make make that doger coin go up please oh no Oh no! All we need is all we need is an actual solid tweet about H bar from him because we did get that H. You did get the H. We did get the H. I saw that now. I was I, was, wow. I was not baited by the H. I'm like, what reality is something good gonna happen for H bar? Not this one. Sorry, <laughs> everybody's blind <laughs> to it. They see he like mean anything tweet else. an H, and they just think, oh, he likes that H. That's, that's what it. I think. He, that's yeah. what I think that he, yeah. I think I mean, his did you see what he named process was. I like that H. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, <laughs> nothing good is ever going to happen for H bar. Sorry, folks. Doctor Lehman, he will he'll make sure something happens for you. Don't worry. Yeah. Well, he Man's he already happen. did his part. He already did his part. He like made a really good technology. We gotta wait for the rest of the stuff to yeah, happen. You need the marketing team to kick in. Like, please buy buy it. My bag. You need, you need Ubisoft. <laughs> you need Ubisoft to make a NFT project on Hedera, and that will blow up. Yeah. They 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 did try. I don't know if it got canceled or something. They were making. Uh, it's called like Tezos, right? Is it pronounced Tezos? I can never yeah. tell how to pronounce half things. They were doing something. Ubisoft was doing something with Tezos where they were like doing their NFT platform. Um, and gamers hated it. They're like, ah, oh, no. ah, you know, we've been suffering through these microtransactions. Now we're getting super microtransactions. It's like, honestly, if anything, it's less bad because you can sell the Fortnite skin, you know? Yeah. yeah. You can, oh, yeah. you can own the thing. You like the people who like spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on like FIFA stuff. Oh. And then the new <laughs> game comes out and it's like, goodbye. Sorry. Mm-hmm. At least, at least, if it was an NFT, you could like transfer it somewhere. No, they wouldn't allow before that. You... No, they wouldn't. Of course not. No. No. EA this is, is like EA. no, no, no. The, so, the yeah, number I, I one worst company them, in the yeah. U.S. for like five years in a row. Yeah. 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 EA is terrible. Yeah. They just re- and them, they and, them just... and Comcast. Bad. We should we should do something about them boys. I'm building a team. <laughs> it's impossible. Give me a posse. I just want Round them up. back. Yeah, over here we had uh, Bright House, and then they merged with Spectrum. And like, I don't I don't really have like a major problem with Spectrum, but like Bright House was cool because it seemed like a small. It, it was a pretty massive. You know, they did cable, they did internet, phone, all that stuff. They ran it like a family business. So like, you would call their customer service line if something was down, and and like. They'd, they'd let you know when they were going to fix it, and then they'd be like, here's a coupon for three free movies uh-huh. that you can watch whenever you want. Or like, God. you know, here's here's like 20 bucks off your bill, or like whatever. Like, they were super dope about it, where Spectrum's like, you gotta wait 12 hours, and we're gonna charge you double on that one there, Hoss. <laughs> so, uh, you know... <clears throat> Yeah, nah. Yeah, mo- yeah most, of my, uh, most of my experience was Spectrum. They used to be called... Charter. Char- Charter, right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They, they've been consistently the same. They're not as bad as Comcast, but they're not great. I think no. they've been like slowly getting worse, but it's better they will, to slowly as they get bigger. quickly get worse. As Russia I'll take continues it. to cyber attack us, then it'll <laughs> continue to. So, okay, this is the perfect time for me to give you my really hot take about Russia and Ukraine. Okay, I'm very knowledgeable, as you have been able to tell from my, this podcast. I just don't even like it. 
should we stand like Nancy Pelosi and start like clapping like a seal? That was so cue, cue the Adam Sessler gif of him. Oh like, no! Clapping like this for oh, women's rights no. or whatever that he was trying to do. Yeah, we're getting canceled after this one. Pull him out. Oh sassy. Oh sassy. Oh, sassy. Oh, sassy. <sighs> well, boys, yep. I'm buying you an NFT. For me. <laughs> 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 two, two weeks of eating oh my god <laughs> two weeks of new what are they meant for what are they meant for on average do you like change the mint price or how does it work it's so just I've, only cha- I've only changed it once um they they came out they were 250 h bar each um keep in mind once again I'm not doing a thousand mints each one only has 10 mints and then, because I think the price of HBAR was about 45 cents then. And since it went down to 22, 25 cents on a good day, I, I upped the price to uh, 300. There you go. Uh, yeah. So, but usually when I do collabs, I make it cheaper. And then, so say once you sell them, you obviously collected. Uh, do you take royalties on any of the like trading that goes on? Between yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I started I started taking I did 10% royalties because the guy that does H Borgs who taught me a lot of stuff about NFTs, um, I asked him, Hey, what is the royalties thing? I don't know what that is. He's like, Oh, just put just put 10. And I've kept it 10 ever since. <laughs> hey, it works. It works out, that's for sure. <laughs> I feel sure like I, I feel like I've only had like like three or four secondary sales anyway. I'm like, whoa. 10 H bar, yeah! More food! <laughs> More food! <laughs> Noodles Another for a day! Of food. <laughs> I'm gonna eat! <laughs> oh. Well, I mean, if you have any other questions, feel free to ask. But, Orlock, we appreciate having you. Mm-hmm. I loved, loved being here. Bring me back every week, and I'll just like, <laughs> talk over everyone. <laughs> and then ask you the thing about Crete is. <laughs> yeah, and then ask yourself questions. That was my favorite part. Yeah. 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 So, Warlock, are you the coolest or, or what? Of course I am. Of course I'm the coolest. G- give me a break. Is the Warlock... No. Be quiet, Patches. I'm talking. Is the, vo- is the voice coming out? No, the Warlock does not sound like that. The Warlock sounds like this. Uh. <laughs> I'm so lonely every day oh, is no. a struggle. <laughs> you should be an actor or a voice actor, something. Someday, friends. Someday. You'll create your when own Hollywood learns. <laughs> when Hollywood <laughs> learns, like, don't Hollywood look at all these people with experience. Go for the NFT creator. That's that's your market. That's your that's that's gonna get you <laughs> famous. With famous peach pieces like Glib Glop. Glare. <laughs> Shush, Glorble. Glorble. Hey, are you, spo- are you spoiling new creeds? <laughs> I told you that in confidence it was going to be Schlibble and Glop Gloop. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you once again, Warlock, for your time. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks, Warlock. Thank you for having me. I hope uh, hope all these people subscribe to my YouTube channel instead. I hope they unsubscribe from you <laughs> and then subscribe to me. That's what I hope. Well, this has been the All Things Podcast, and and we enjoy every (laughs) single one. Before he continues to burn down (laughs) this podcast. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next episode. you gotta do that sign-off again. (laughs) You gotta do that sign-off again. You cut out. You cut out. Oh, thank you for the All Things Podcast. We appreciate every single one of you for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and Warlock, you are canceled. (laughs) Wow!